The Fox Eats the Rabbit is a predator-prey simulation task. The essential question it answers is what happens to a population when a new predator is introduced. Students will also examine the dependence of organisms on one another and their environments. In the task, students are given an envelope containing 300 rabbits and one fox. The fox is 3 inches by 3 inches and the rabbits are each 1 inch by 1 inch. Students are also given a data table to fill in data on 20 generations of rabbit and fox populations for one habitat. The surface of the table is marked off with a 2 foot by 2 foot square to represent the habitat. The students begin the first generation with one fox and three rabbits. The fox is tossed in the habitat and it must catch at least three rabbits in order to survive. In the first generation, it is virtually impossible for the fox to survive. If the fox survives, it produces one offspring for the next generation. The remaining rabbit population doubles after each generation. Students continue tossing the foxes into the habitat throughout 20 generations. This shows how as the fox population increases, the rabbit population decreases. It also shows how the rabbit population increases as the fox population decreases. Students then take data collected and complete a line graph. A line graph is used to show the change in the populations of foxes and rabbits over generational time.